Well, it is time for some great entertainment on your Feel Good Breakfast show. So if you just joined us, you came at the perfect, perfect time. Joining us right now is Gareth James. He's been making waves in the music industry with his unique blend of country and pop and rock influences. I love the coming together of the genres. And he is gearing up to tour the USA. But before we get into that, before he leaves us in South Africa, we've got to check out his talent. The world don't need it. Box preach, talking about streets of gold. Just someone they can lean on and a steady hand to hold. We don't need bigger churches, so as high as steeples. We need deeper love, something oh, yeah, yes. Yes. yes, oh that. man, how you doing? It's cool. good to have you back. Yeah. I was blown away by your voice the first time you came here and I've been a fan ever since, bro. Uh, I think that the States are going to be blown away by you when you do get there. But let's just talk about what's happening right now because cool. singles being launched, uh, happened in Feb. People are loving it, I'm assuming. Yeah, it's getting response has been great. Mm. Yeah, and, and, and how's that feeling for you? I mean, it's, it's, it's quite an acknowledgement, right? You know, I actually had the most amazing thing happen to me the other night. Oh, it's yeah. nice. I came, I did a show and this lady came up to me and she said, um, please tell me that you're doing better people tonight. Because oh. if you're not, I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> and the funny thing was that as soon as I'd done with the song, she left. Oh, my God. Oh, she wow. really just came for that song. Wow. And the people know what they want, clearly. Yeah. Yeah. And you're giving it to them. Yeah. <laughs> well, Gareth, what do you think it is about that song that just had a heart? Um, it's, I think it's the message, because mm. the message is really strong about, you know, that I think people preach too much and yeah. do li too little, mm. you know? And I think that's really what the story is about, is just sure. to stop preaching and start doing more, you know? It's not, it's, yeah. it's not difficult to be a good person, you know? I don't think so at all. It's all yeah. in the action, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. And I love that. And I love that we get to experience that a little bit later. I can't wait to sing along with it. But I know that you're going to be leaving SA Soil soon and we're going to be sad to let you go for a couple of months. You're headed to the USA. Tell me what goes into prep to actually go on a tour in a completely different space and how are you anticipating them to receive you? Well, I've been talking to, because uh, I'm touring with another, with a local artist, yeah. an American artist, and um, he's, he's basically just said to me that Look, bottom line is mm. they love South Africans. Mm. This is what he's telling me. Yes. Mm. So I'm, to be honest with you, I have no idea what to expect. Mm. I'm excited. I'm like sort of torn because I want to be with my family, but I really need to do this. Like, mm. you know, um, but you know, the excitement's been overwhelming and I don't know. I don't know. I hope they're going to like me. Yeah. They better. This your first <laughs> they better. This is your first time in the States. My first time. Man, I, I think they're going to love you because you see our big countries over there and you've got that feeling, you've got rock, you've got all this, the good stuff that I think is going to just resonate with the people right now. I mean, for someone as a South African with a country that has so many diverse uh, tastes when it comes to music, absolutely. look what you've done in a country like this. You've gotten such a big crowd. You've gotten so many people behind you and there's still just more to come. On top of that, I also believe you're heading over to the Texas Awards. Yes, I am. What's the reason behind that? So that that was actually that was actually a nomination last year, but last year didn't quite work out the way I'd, I'd hoped. Yeah. And then when I released Better People, then they contacted me again for a second mm. time, which is not something that happens every day. So I'm like really excited about that. So all the way from Texas, they hear your music. They're like, we need this man out here on our soil so we can celebrate him. Yeah. Is that what you're telling me is happening? I think so. But you understand <laughs> the gravitas <laughs> of this man? Yeah, this yeah. is huge. Yeah, it's really cool, you know, because they, they've got like, this, like a small committee of people that like mm. scour social media for independent artists. Mm. And that, that's really just how they found me. Wow. Really from social media. And to them, just so you're aware, you're an international talent to them, right? Yeah. You thought I, about I, that. Last year, I won, I won two country music awards in South Africa. Yeah. And, and, you know, to South Africans, it's really not that impressive. Because mm -hmm. to be honest with you, I didn't even know there was a South African country. Yeah. <laughs> you know I mean? And you're in the that's scene. Yeah. And they are like, oh, this guy won yeah. two country music awards in South Africa. You know what I mean? I'm like, it's different. I suppose it's weird. I'll, I'll... It's all relative. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, exactly. And I absolutely yeah. love that. I did have a quick question about the excitement that you felt. Like, what is your form of celebration when you hear things like, Texas is calling me up, say, come through today. What do you do? You know, I'm a, um, I express myself best in music. Yeah. So when it comes to like exciting things, mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't seem excited, but mm -hmm. my, my heart is exploding. Ooh. You know what I mean? <laughs> I, I love that, man, because I feel like if you can tap into that, right, you're currently on this positive tra trajectory. Mm -hmm. So good news is happening and you celebrate that good news by singing. So theoretically, the momentum that's already started is just going to be a snowball. Mm -hmm. 
the more success is going to come, the better your music is. Bro, I love what I'm seeing here. This yeah. is looking like a great future for you, man. <laughs> oh, with, that, with that being said, what, what do you think we can expect for your future? Because it yeah. seems like you're just knocking every challenge that comes your way. Sure. Well, you know, I think, I th look, I think I've been raised by, by the whole thing about, you know, hard work, mm -hmm. you know, pays off at the end of the yeah. day. Yeah. And I'm, I've got no issue working. So <sighs> whatever the next challenge is, I'm, I'm planning on knocking that thing down too. Yes. So. Well, why don't we challenge That's him right now? Hey, why don't we do that right now? You see Get how he knocks it out the box. <laughs> and run as fast as you can to the other side of the studio because we're going to see you perform. Yeah. Oh my oh, goodness, guys. Guys, thank you so much, this. man. We'll let you do your thing, but you, this go, is what go, I'm talking go. about, yeah. right? You can feel the passion. You can yeah. feel the fact that I think this resonates with a global audience. Absolutely. The yeah. fact that it comes from South Africa just shows you that we have such incredible diverse it. talent. Yeah. And we get to see that right now. I can't wait, personally. <laughs> Let's get into it. A great performance awaits you. So let me not talk anymore. Let the music do the talking.